right on. Okay, let's um, let's do um some sanitary piping. I'm gonna do the sanitary piping for these two laboratories. Another laboratory it looks like a floor drain and a water closet and two more laboratories and a another floor drain so let's get started ah, okay let's get started let's get started let's get started okay so our section view so we have uh, sanitary coming down let's do that and let's check our settings one and a half inch is good the slope is off and we have sanitary we're gonna need sanitary pvc sanitary okay so that looks good we're gonna come down and look at our system type and our pipe types looks okay so we're gonna go over make sure that nothing is sloping again nothing is sloping and we go down here so we need a p-trap here and let's get that p-trap there let's move it back up some okay i'm gonna leave that there and go here and make this sanitary t let's go up a little bit put a cap on this guy and double the sanitary t let's make a little spool piece to come out okay we are yeah okay that's good and okay we're gonna move this back into the wall area so we can start our other laboratory okay so let's go down and check clockwise one half no slope pvc sanitary and pvc sanitary we're going to come down and what we're looking for is the hidden line that's going to come right there that's the one we want so we can connect right there and our p-trap is going to go there so we have our piping let's check to make sure our fixed unit says two and the fixed unit is two that's good okay now let's go continue and we can move this pipe um up and down however we want this really doesn't matter um so just next let's draw our pipe and go to our overall and we're gonna start here but we're gonna need to slope down at a quarter inch because it's less than three inches just just because plumbing code the international plumbing code has a um, table to look at okay so next because let's let's check our slope quarter inch per foot and because the water closet is going to require a four inch pipe so we're going to go to our systems pipe clockwise four inch slope is down but we are going to slope at an eighth inch per foot okay let's go down all the way down to here because we're gonna pick up these two 
or these three fixtures of two laboratories and the floor drain. Okay, so let's let's bring over. Let's make sure we have an eighth inch, eighth inch, one eighth inch. Okay, and I'm going to extend our quarter inch. Oh, you know what? I'm, let's go back and change this pipe to a two inch. Okay. Just because. Just because. Just because. Go back. Uh, okay. And let's look at the difference. Because we're going to need. But before I do that, I need to change my. Pipe fitting uh, pipe types, so that's going to be sanitary and the properties. I need to change this reducing junction to a combination at this point, okay? Because if you go horizontal, horizontal fittings, it has to be a combination. This would be a Y and an eighth inch bin or 45. Okay, so let's look at the section. We are over here. That looks pretty good. Uh, I'm gonna bring our eighth inch pipe down, 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 just to get a estimate. So, and now drawing construction lines at the middle of our pipe will give us a better connection you can do however whatever process is better for you but for me this seems to work pretty good okay so from here I'm gonna select pipe all of our pipe so that when we line up our pipe to our um, other pipe, uh, looks pretty good. Okay, so now let's move over and trim the extended pipe and go back to our floor. Mm -hmm. Go back to our floor plan. Okay, I think we're finished with our detail line. And go back to our floor plan. Okay, and just drag until we see the blue line, which is going to be our... Okay. And let's put a... Let's see, so we still have an eighth inch on our four inch and we have a quarter inch on our two inch pipe okay and i'm going to just let's bring this down into the wall just because and that's going to be the clean out so we have those two looks like everything is good everything is good everything is good so we now let's pick up our other laboratory that's our pipe and let's just make sure one half inch slope is off slope is off okay everything looks good properties make sure that we have a pipe type of sanitary and a system type of sanitary go here and again we need to look for the hidden line that will connect and that looks like it so we come down and connect uh, into our pipe let's not forget our p-trap okay and this can go either way but let's just go there and let's take a look looks like it's, it's okay Floor drain, so we can get our uh, floor drain. 
Okay. Section. Uh, I might need to come down. Let's see how much we got. Hmm. You know what? Let's go back. And this is one half inch. I don't want that to be a one half inch. I want it to be a two inch. Let's see what happens. Two inch. Okay. Cool. We like that. Isn't that just lovely? That's just lovely, lovely, lovely. Okay. Back to the floor drain. Let's bring this guy down. Three inch floor drain. Slope is off. Sanitary, sanitary, sanitary. Here. And here. And we need a P trap again. Let's P trap here. And bring that up. Okay, and it looks like a straw detail line, and maybe we have that much room. I'm just gonna use that and trim our three inch back to there, and delete. So we're gonna need to bring down our four inch, which will do and select all of our pipe. I'm doing control and select and go back so and then shift arrow down uh, uh, that looks good okay now again we want to look for the hidden line so that it is lining up right there and from here we can connect into our four inch pipe let's make sure that we have a connection here that's a combination y right combination fitting coming <laughs> okay so let's go overall again and let's get the water closet hmm that looks tight so let's see what have we got ah it looks tight 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 Hmm. <clears throat> Four inch, no slope, no slope, no slope, no slope. Okay, let's come down and see how far we can get. All right. So the hidden line is going to be there. Uh, I don't like that. It should be about right there. So let's move. Let's move our pipe over. Control. Control. We need to move over. I'm gonna get this fitting also. Okay. I think that's good. So let's go section. And we're gonna move to the right. Right, 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 right. I'm gonna leave it there. Okay. So we're looking for hidden line, right? So we can make the correct connection. Correct right there. And we can drag our pipe down to there. Okay, now let's take a look again and make sure that our water closet is connected. So we got one, two, three, four, and we have fixture units. Let's see. Okay, so we got 11 fixture units, which is adding up. This should be, what, less than six? Less than, less than, okay. So we got five and three. Okay, we're good. Now, hmm, let's do the floor drain. This guy, this floor drain. And what I'm going to need to do is rotate my section view so that it is facing west. And because I want to go back and my pipe go back to the wall, right? This is the wall. So we're going to need to look at our floor drain here. Here, right? Three inch, no slope. Okay. Here. 
all the way back to the wall and down okay and also gonna need that P trap right just in case make sure that there's no odors coming out from there so from here we are going to draw a pipe and let's go back to the floor plan so from here we're gonna need to go over I'm gonna connect into this pipe so we are gonna three inch we're sloping down right at an eighth inch eighth of an inch coming out at 135 right and over now okay so we're still at an eighth. Everybody's at an eighth. We're good at an eighth. Nice, nice, nice. I like it. I like it. Okay. So let's see what the difference is in elevation. Let's rotate again. Our, so that we're looking north this time. Here. Right? Okay. So. Ooh. Looks like we're going to have to come up so what are the restrictions if we come up this is our only restriction right so i'm going to control select control select go back hmm should i do a window tile nah let's just eyeball it let's go up let's go up let's go up let's go up 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 something's not right that's not right. Something's not right. Something's not right. Overall. Section. Wait, 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 wait. Let's go back. Why is the screen moving? Okay, now. Okay. I don't know why the screen was moving. Uh, okay, and the same, use the same process, draw a detail line, right, so that we can construct, hmm, okay, just taking our time, just taking our time, let's extend, extend, Okay, so it looks like we're going to need to come up. I'm going to go back and get all of this pipe. All of this pipe. So, looks like we got a little room there. Uh, go back to our section view and let's go up until we get... That looks good. Mm, down. Yeah, I like that. Okay. And go back to trim out just a little bit of this guy. Okay. And we are here and there. Uh, control, tab, and delete. Plan view or overall. And again, we're going to drag till we see the blue line over to there nice we like that we like that we like that okay so i think that that's gonna be it for now um uh let's um so i'm gonna stop it there and continue with another video um so i hope that helped and um it's not as difficult as it looks and it can be very difficult if you don't practice so i hope that helped and i'll talk to you guys later